Well, good afternoon, South Florida. I'm Andrew Perez and I'm Alexis Frazier. Here's a look at your top stories today. Authorities are currently investigating reports of a body found floating in a canal that divides plantation and Davie. A number of officers from the Broward Sheriff's Office responded to Sewell Lock, a canal along State Road 84 by the Davie Road exit. First responders remain on the scene, both fire rescue and police. Local 10 has since reached out to BSO for more information. Also, a new video shows the aftermath of a massive fire inside a Miami Garden store facility on Saturday. At least one firefighter was taken to the hospital, reportedly suffering minor injuries. The giant fire erupted inside an extra space storage facility near State Road 7 and Northwest 176th Street. More than three dozen Miami-Dade fire rescue units were called to the scene where they found heavy smoke billowing out of that building. The facility remains closed this morning while an investigation continues. Deputies are investigating a shooting in Pompano Beach that sent one man to the hospital. They responded near the intersection of Northwest 19th Avenue and 4th Street around 1 a.m. Saturday. This is where they found the man suffering from multiple gunshot wounds. He was taken to a nearby hospital for treatment, but is expected to survive. Deputies are now searching for the shooter. Also, this new disturbing video showing the aftermath of a scene after an SUV driver flew right off an I-95 overpass Saturday. You can see here the wreck left behind after the vehicle went flying. It landed on the 300 block of Flagler Street. Bystanders immediately jumped in trying to pull that driver to safely safety. According to Miami Fire Rescue, that patient was stable and taken to the hospital, but only as a precaution. Remember, as breaking news happens, we've got you covered on air and online. Head over to local10.com for more local news coverage and updates.